This is a true and remarkable story. It was before the First World War that two boys were born on one and the same street in Tsarist Riga. The war separated both friends and they landed in two opposite worlds. Geniuses, Russian film director Sergei Eisenstein and British philosopher Isaiah Berlin met once again 30 years later. We base our story on what they recollected about their early lives. From Valkyries and 21 ways to commit suicide in Eisenstein's vigorous imagination to Berlin's nightmares about a naked woman with a horse. For both, the dreams just added to their creative power. While young, they fell for both men and women. Later on, their sexual obsessions and femme fatales were poets and actresses. Their conflicting desires fueled their lives. Hours spent in psychoanalytic discussions with Freud, or even Chaplin, lecturing in Oxford and Cambridge to stunned audiences, being trapped in a never-ending choice between communism, capitalism, pacifism, and even fascism. They made fun of Lenin and Hitler, were punished by Stalin. Ideological regimes took away their birthplace. Even so, they continued to be implacable fighters against the stupidity of authoritarianism. They survived the darkest days of war, the blockade of Leningrad, the Holocaust, but could never escape deadly loneliness. It turned out that they were on their own in this world, yet they could rely on a distant and shadowy friend with whom their lives and deaths ran strikingly in parallel.